Hey guys, it's Tim, and this is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. We already know that Kurt Angle will be headlining the Hall of Fame class of 2017. Other names speculated for the Hall of Fame this year, Beth Phoenix, Diamond Dallas Page, Rick Rude, and others. Well, another name has come up over this past weekend, and that name is Teddy Long. Teddy Long has been in wrestling longer than most people really realize, and he even managed The Undertaker before The Undertaker was in the WWE. Teddy Long has pretty much done it all in professional wrestling other than, you know, wrestle. He's been a manager. He's been a general manager. He's done commentary. He's been a referee. When he first started in the WWE, he was a actually high-level WWE referee, refereeing a lot of big matches. But hey, Teddy Long coming into the WWE's Hall of Fame, I can see the justifiability of that. I can see where they would say, hey, Teddy's a big enough name for what he did and his longevity. So hey, Teddy Long in the WWE Hall of Fame, holla if you hear me. Finn Balor was recently asked on Twitter, what are the odds of you showing up at the Royal Rumble? And he responded, 30 to 1. Then another fan said, well, I recently heard that the doctors cleared you to wrestle. And Finn just responded with, thanks, doctor. So I don't think Finn Balor is coming back. I get questions on the daily. When's Finn coming back? Will Finn be in the Rumble? Where is Finn? Why haven't we seen him yet? He's recuperating. He's recovering from major shoulder surgery. Originally, they went in and thought, okay, you'll be good by January. We're going to do this surgery real quick. Bada boom. They went in and the surgery took five times as long because it was worse than they originally suspected. Finn Balor was then told, you know, you should make it back in time for WrestleMania. And that's the plan. Right now, everybody in the WWE is under the assumption that Finn Balor is returning no earlier than, th than the middle of of March just in time to set something up for WrestleMania. So Finn can essentially come back in March and not even do anything physical until WrestleMania. And that would be a good bet. But that's going to do it for this edition of Pro Wrestling Unlimited. Remember to comment below, like and share this video, like us on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter and subscribe here on YouTube.